Diana Muldor, a stalwart figure in the entertainment industry, has left an indelible mark through a career defined by versatility and enduring qualities. When considering her vast body of work, one might ponder which among her legendary roles truly encapsulates the essence of her career. However, it is the timeless nature of her contributions that positions her as an everlasting symbol of the industry. Maldor's ability to seamlessly transition between genres and characters, coupled with a nuanced approach to acting, has solidified her status as a fixture in the annals of Hollywood history. One could argue that it is the sum total of her diverse roles, rather than a singular defining moment, that characterizes her career. From her compelling performances in classic television series to her memorable appearances on the big screen, Muldor's impact extends across various mediums. Her enduring qualities, including a commanding presence and an innate ability to breathe life into any character, have contributed to a legacy that transcends specific roles or projects. As we reflect on the multifaceted career of Diana Muldor, we invite you to share your most cherished memories or personal experiences related to this iconic Hollywood actor. What role or moment stands out to you and why? We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below, celebrating the richness of Muldor's contribution to the world of entertainment. Diana Muldor, a 1960 graduate of Sweet Briar College, found herself at a unique crossroads in January 2013. After years of being a caregiver to her husband, she sought to reignite her acting career and chose Martha's Vineyard, Ma USA, as the backdrop for this endeavor. Before this career revival, Muldor had left her mark in the science fiction realm by playing scientists on the original Star Trek series. Her involvement continued in 1987 when she took on the role of Dr. Pulaski on Star Trek The Next Generation. Interestingly, she agreed to accept the role on the condition that the character's first name be changed to Catherine. This decision had a ripple effect on other productions, with Gates McFadden briefly stepping away from Star Trek and being replaced by Ann Archer in Patriot Games, where the character also adopted the name Catherine. Notably, 40 years after her graduation, Muldor returned to Sweet Briar College as the commencement speaker on May 7, 2000. This marked a full-circle moment for the actress, showcasing both her educational roots and her enduring presence in the entertainment industry. Diana Muldor's journey is a testament to resilience and reinvention from her academic beginnings to her impactful roles on iconic sci-fi series. The twists and turns of her career reflect a woman who navigated challenges with grace, leaving an indelible mark on the entertainment landscape. Diana Muldor, known for her versatile career in acting, has another side that often goes unnoticed by many. Beyond the glitz of Hollywood, she is a fairly well-known breeder, owner, and judge of Airedale Terriers. Her passion for these dogs adds a unique layer to her persona, showcasing a lesser-known aspect of her life outside the entertainment industry. While she's celebrated for her roles, it's intriguing to discover this quieter passion of hers. Muldor's involvement in the world of Airedale Terriers sheds light on her multifaceted interests beyond the camera. This lesser-known facet of her life brings a distinct charm to the narrative, presenting a side of the actress that often stays in the shadows. Her dedication to breeding and judging Airedale Terriers not only reveals a different dimension to her character, but also highlights her commitment to pursuits beyond the limelight. It's a testament to her diverse interests and the depth of her engagement in various aspects of life. In exploring Diana Muldor's journey, it's fascinating to consider the balance she struck between her Hollywood career and her involvement in the world of Airedale Terriers. This unique combination of pursuits adds a layer of complexity to her story, showcasing a woman who found fulfillment in both the glamour of showbiz and the quieter joys of canine companionship. Diana Muldor's role as a breeder, owner, and judge of Airedale Terriers reflects a fascinating intersection of passion and profession, providing a glimpse into the lesser-known aspects of her life. It's a reminder that behind every public figure lies a mosaic of interests and experiences, and Muldor's story is no exception. Diana Muldor's versatility extends beyond the screen, delving into her family connections and the world of theater. Notably, she shares a familial bond with singer-songwriter Jeff Muldor, adding a musical note to her personal background. In the 1960s, she collaborated with her L.A. Lore co-star Richard Dysart at New York's renowned Circle in the Square Theater, showcasing her early theater experience. Beyond her acting prowess, Muldor served on the Screen Actors Guild board and later ascended to the presidency of the Academy of Television Arts and Sciences. 
This shift from board member to president underscores her deep involvement in the industry's administrative aspects. Diana Muldor's journey involves not just her on-screen accomplishments, but also her connections, theatrical roots, and leadership roles, creating a multifaceted profile that goes beyond the spotlight. Diana Muldor's connections extend beyond the screen, reaching into the realm of family ties and the challenges faced during her acting career. While her versatile roles and contributions to Hollywood are well documented, a lesser known aspect involves her familial connections. Muldor is the aunt of Jenny Muldor and Claire Manchon, revealing a familial thread that adds depth to her personal life. In addition to her familial ties, Muldor's acting career faced its share of hurdles. During her stint on Star Trek, The Next Generation in 1987, director Paul Lynch disclosed that she encountered difficulties remembering her lines. To address this, cue cards were employed to assist her during filming, highlighting the pragmatic solutions taken to support her performance. Beyond the glamour of Hollywood and the intricacies of her roles, these aspects of Diana Muldor's life shed light on the complexities and challenges that shaped her journey in the entertainment industry. From family connections to on-set challenges, her story goes beyond the spotlight, portraying a woman with multifaceted experiences that have left an indelible mark on her career. Diana Muldor's on-screen journey is marked by her portrayal of diverse Doctor characters in the Star Trek franchise. From the open-minded biologist Dr. Ann Mulhall to the insightful psychologist Dr. Miranda Jones and the compassionate physician Dr. Catherine Pulaski, Muldor left an indelible mark on Trek lore. Notably, Playmates Toys even released an action figure resembling her character Dr. Pulaski from Star Trek The Next Generation. In a commemoration of Star Trek's 40th anniversary, Muldor, after a decade's hiatus from Star Trek conventions, participated in one held in Las Vegas on set. 1526, joining fellow Star Trek veterans in celebrating the iconic series. Diana Muldor's contributions to Star Trek extend beyond the screen, with her characters embodying an open-minded view of the universe. The Playmates Toys action figure stands as a tangible testament to the lasting impact of her role as Dr. Pulaski. Her return to Star Trek conventions after 10 years further emphasizes the enduring connection she maintains with the beloved franchise. In this article, we delve into Diana Muldor's unique portrayal of Doctor characters in Star Trek, exploring the lasting legacy of her roles and her notable return to the Star Trek convention circuit after a decade. As the curtain falls on our exploration of the fascinating world of film and television, we find ourselves lingering in the luminous glow of Diana Muldor's captivating performances. Her artistry has woven a tapestry of characters that have left an indelible mark on the hearts of audiences worldwide. Now, dear reader, it's your turn to step into the spotlight. Reflect upon the moments when Muldor's on-screen presence stirred something within you. Whether it's her commanding performances in classic roles or her nuanced portrayals that resonated with your own experiences, let those memories surface. Consider this outro an open invitation to share your reflections, to illuminate the mosaic of personal connections we all hold with the world of entertainment. Your thoughts are the brushstrokes that paint the canvas of our collective appreciation. In the spirit of celebration, we express our gratitude for Diana Muldor's profound impact on the landscape of storytelling. Her contributions have enriched our cultural tapestry, leaving an enduring legacy that continues to inspire and captivate. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the cinematic realms touched by the brilliance of Diana Muldor. Your time and interest are the beating heart of our exploration, and we look forward to hearing your thoughts and memories.